Do you know that the human head weighs eight pounds? I think thanks to Jerry Maguire, we all did, right? <laughs> That's for sure. Well, the six-year-old who uttered that famous line, Jonathan Lipnicki, is now 26. And while he's getting back into the acting game, Jonathan tells me life after Jerry Maguire wasn't so easy. After Jerry Maguire, you became this huge international star. How did that affect you as a young kid growing up? At first, just a lot of attention. Like, I, I can't, I'd come off just having a summer where I had Stuart Little 2 and like Mike both come out in the same summer. And so it was a really big time for me. And then middle school was the worst time of my life. There was a lot of, you know, bullying I dealt with. And um, I was definitely dealing with a lot of, uh, and I still to this day, it's a battle, you know, anxiety and depression have been uh, a part of my life. Everyone goes, oh, you know, it must be great to be Jonathan Lipnicki. And I'm like, man, I would be, I'd pay to be anybody but Jonathan Lipnicki. These days, Jonathan is happy just being himself. And though he struggled through his childhood, he still has lots of love for his Jerry Maguire co-star Cuba Gooding Jr. And the feeling is mutual. You love Cuba as much as he loves you. We were just with him yesterday. Oh my God. And he had a little special message for you. I love you, dude. Keep doing your thing. It was great because you know real talents. Like I'm sure it was like when you saw Jodie Foster and, and Shirley Temple. He has that. That's quite a compliment. Shirley Temple, sure. I know. Yeah. I mean. Yeah. For someone like that to say something so nice, you know, it just reaffirms what, it, what I'm doing in my life. It's getting stronger. It's in my mouth. Window, window. The 26 year old is returning to the big screen in the new independent film, Pitching Tents. It's a little film with a lot of heart and it is about following your dreams. He's also adding producer and writer to his resume. And I wanted to add matchmaker to mine. Who is your celebrity crush? I mean, growing up, it's always been Scarlett Johansson, you know, definitely. But I mean, I have a lot of crushes. There are a lot of. Maybe I could hook it up. Uh, <laughs> I don't know, being put on the spot. Taylor Swift? <laughs> <laughs> no. You look like my next mistake. I'm sure she's lovely. I just don't, I don't want any songs about me. I'll tell you. 